There's an Easter egg that completely changes the game for camel grinding in Black Ops 6 Zombies. Seriously? It fixes the main issue with Liberty Falls and makes camel grinding a million times easier. So let's go in game, do the Easter egg, and use it to easily unlock all the camos for the AK-47, including the two special camos and, of course, gold. And if you want to see more camel grinds like this in the future, make sure to unlock the subscribe button. Okay, we haven't done this before, but if it works, it's going to completely change how we camel grind here in Black Ops 6, and it's going to speed it up massively. Because for the most part, I've gone back to Terminus Island because there's something Liberty Fall doesn't have, at least not right away. And Liberty Falls not having this makes it a lot less effective for camo grinding. Until now. All we've got to do is an Easter egg, which hopefully we can get first try. Oh, but first we got to get points to open the map. And the weapon we're grinding out today is the AK. The good old AK. With the Cherry Blossom camo, which looks super clean in this game. Oh, I put in single fire trying to inspect it. So that's the plan for today. Do the Easter egg, make the camo grinding easier, get the gold AK. Profit. All right, round six, still building up points. Thank you. Uh, I think that might be enough points. We should be able to do this now. So deactivate the Rampage Inducer. That's going to make it super hard. Let's leave one zombie. Clear the round. Uh, punch the vending machine. Oh, we'll take that. All right, we've left the zombie. Open this door. Open this door. Then we're going to head on top of the Speed Cola area, and we're going to buy this sniper rifle right here. And it should give us our zombie build. Yes, sir. Because, yeah, this Easter egg involves a sniper rifle. Uh, the mm, I wish we were brought in a decoy, but we'll be all right. So we got to head up to the graveyard all the way to the back. Come up here. And if we look out here, there should be cans. Cans? There they are. And if we shoot all of these cans quick enough, um, something special happens. I think we only get one try at this. So let's kill the zombie. All right, go, 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 go. We're on a time limit. We got to shoot all the cans. Nope. No, no, no. That's not a good... Oh, no. Nope. Once you shoot the first can is when the timer starts. One more can left. Boom. And there we go. Free dead shot. And the reason this is so important, because if you know Liberty Falls, the only other way to get dead shot is to buy it from the Wonder Fizz machine. And that doesn't spawn until round 25. So normally, you can't get dead shot on this map till round 25. But you can get it for free every single game by shooting down those cans quick enough. Round 8, Liberty Falls dead shot by ammo. Now, if we dead shot spam... Oh, look at that. There we go. The reason dead shot's so crucial, because the first step for camo grinding on pretty much any weapon is to get 2,000 headshots. And having dead shot not only makes it where your aim automatically aims to the head, you also do significantly more damage for headshots. So it massively increases your headshot count. So pretty safe to say we're going to be doing that every single game from now on. Sorry, groundskeeper. You count as a crit kill. I'm just glad there's a sniper wall by, so we don't have to spawn in with a sniper. Yeah, you got to buy the sniper each time, but the sniper is super cheap. Honestly, cheaper than just buying Deadshot. Look at that. And once we get our augment upgrades for Deadshot, it's going to be even more important because we could do double damage for the first headshot on a zombie and we could do increased critical damage. So all around Deadshot is key, which kind of sucks it's not on the map. I would prefer for them just to add the Deadshot perk machine, but hey, a free Easter egg to get it works for me as well. Okay, I'm actually going to punch the pack punch machine because I want to keep Cherry Blossom. There we go. The headshot power of Deadshot Daiquiri. All right, come on. We got camos to grind, bugs. There we go. Sam trial has appeared on the map. What do we got to do? I normally do these Sam trials because they'll spawn in extra zombies, especially on earlier rounds. Super easy way to get some extra headshots. Oh, kill, kill zombies while standing. All right. Stand still, get kills. Stand still, get kills. Oh, dead shot. So nice. Oh, all right. What do we get? Oh, Stamina up. I'll take that. So two free perks this game. Now, if you want to be really smart about it, you get a bunch of perks before doing the dead shot Easter egg because perks get more and more expensive, but no matter what, you're going to get dead shot for free. You know, Sam, I don't even want to do your trial. I just want the extra zombie spawns. Temporary perk applied. Oh, uh, I don't know. Nah, don't make me drink it right now. All right. Melee Macchiato. Use Melee Macchiato to kill zombies. Yeah, I don't think so, Sam. I think I'm just going to shoot these zombies in the head, but appreciate it. Oh, yeah. Thank you for the extra spawn, Sam. Now, unfortunately, you don't really get any points for killing these extra zombies, but they do count for camos, which is all that we care about. You can keep the points game. I want the camos. Points are temporary. Camos are forever. All right, Sam, I'll get one with melee macchiato to keep you happy. I'll get two. Uh, I think it's about time we get some armor. Oh, um, uh, before I forget, there is something special we need to put on our gun because it massively helps on this map. Good old napalm burst. Honestly, I should probably start researching napalm burst. I don't think I have any of the upgrades for it yet. I feel like getting the augments for Deadshot and Napalm Burst would really be helpful. 
Goodbye. How's that napalm taste? Oh, this one just kills zombies. Yes, Sam. I could do that. Yeah, the only issue about actually doing the progress in the trial is that uh, the spawns go away if you finish it. So maybe we should have killed the zombies outside the zone. Maybe we'll be rewarded for it. Eh, I mean, free stuff's free stuff. You know, actually, I have an idea. That's not the only thing we can use to spawn in free zombies. So get the water valve, then we're going to head to the bowling lanes. And what if we start cranking it right here? I know cranking this makes zombies spawn in. So on a lower round, can we get a lot more spawns by doing this? Oh, that's a lot of zombies. Although, Mangler got to go first. You know, we got a lot of perks, but we should probably invest in upgrading our weapon past pack one. It's also uncommon rarity. But luckily, since we have Deadshot, it's still killing zombies very effectively. Even though it's not very upgraded. Because that extra Deadshot damage. Honestly, Deadshot's the new Double Tap 2.0. The reason you'd buy Double Tap would be to do more damage. Deadshot does more damage. Okay, we're gonna green, blue, purple. That's a massive upgrade. <laughs> yeah, going from green to purple probably gonna be different oh no we failed the crank what if i just started again now that we failed it oh no you're gonna spawn in more zombies oh that's oh i'm sorry that's oh no what a terrible thing to punish me with for failing it i'll learn my lesson next time Ooh, white out unlocked 1500 critical kills nice what we like to see baby Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. We were doing... Oh, come on. Please, please. Ah! Oh, don't, don't! I want a refund. Oh, 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 we got to rise before we lose. Oh, we're about to lose Deadshot. If we lose that, we won't get that. Oh, that is one thing. If you go down and lose Deadshot, you won't be able to get it back to round 25 because I think you can only do that Easter egg once or at least complete it once. That was close. Almost lost Deadshot, which would have been a massive deal. You know, if I was smart, whenever we started getting that massive lag spike, I probably should have paused the game instead of just looking at the zombies, wondering why they weren't moving, which that means we need to buy another self-revive. And we got to rebuy our perks. Oh, but there's no Wonder Fizz yet. We'll open this. I'd be really disappointed if we died now. We're on a roll. We're getting lots of headshots and starting over would take forever. We want to make sure we get our headshots done this game. Honestly, my goal is to get gold this game. I want to finish it all. I wonder what other Easter eggs are in the game that help with camo grinding. This one's huge, but there's probably other Easter eggs out there that help in some way, shape, or form. There we go. Thank you. Take that. And I'll take that. You can keep the other ones. I'm saving for Pack-A-Punch. It feels so good to not be using an LMG. Most of what I've grinded so far in Black Ops 6 Zombies were the LMGs. And you were just so slow. It was so slow to grind. Running backwards, training. But ARs? We have enough to Pack-A-Punch our gun again. I don't know why I'm not. Level 38 on the AK. Look at all the head. Look at it. Oh, Purple Tiger! That is 2,000 critical kills easy yeah that was hands down the best experience i've ever had getting headshots on liberty falls so much easier when you have dead shot from the rip well now that we're done with the headshots we've got to do the two specialty camos but i'm not sure what they are luckily since we're solo we can do a little save and quit yes i'd like to save all right let's see what we got to do next so gunsmith customized camos all right the nine military camos are done we've got to get five critical kills rapidly 15 times sounds easy 300 eliminations while it's pack up oh just while it's pack a bunch easy and since we saved, save file. There we go. And load right back in. And we're back in game. Wait, we had more money than that one. We Doesn't matter. We could buy armor or pack a punch tier three. Yeah, we're going to do pack a punch tier three. Thank you, good sir. Oh, no. We lost cherry blossom. I guess when you save and quit, you got to punch the pack a punch machine again. Well, you live and you learn. Hit, hit, hit. That's a PhD upgrade. Look at this. We run into zombies. Run into zombies. Oh. He gets knocked back. Yeah, get out of here, buddy. Well, back to grinding. Honestly, both these challenges sound easy. We got to get rapid critical kills, which I think it was just five, right? It was five rapid critical kills. Like, I think we should already have two progression for that. That challenge is going to take all of 10 seconds. Then we just got to get 300 kills while pack a punch. So we just essentially get 300 kills. All right. So five rapid crits. See, look at that. Once again, dead shot coming in handy, even for the extra challenges after the headshots. Is that what a Deadeye Metal is? Is a Deadeye Metal five rapid headshots? Let's see. There might be a medal for five rapid headshots. I know a Slaughter Metal is five rapid kills. That's not headshots. Oh, there's another Deadeye Metal. What is a Deadeye Metal? I think Deadeye is the medal we're looking for. I really do. Oh, there it is. Was that Chlorine Camo? All right, I think we just unlocked Chlorine. So that's done. Now we just got to get 300 kills while it's packed. Oh no, that's going to be so hard. However, are we going to get 300 Pack-A-Bunch kills? 
Why does it feel so weird to be crouched like this? Like a shark. Donna. Donna. We are running so fast while... Cr How does this look in third person? All I'm saying is we got to go back and revisit the AK when we make our top 15 best weapon list. Because I feel like it might be on there. Not convinced yet, but... Oh, there it is. Haunted camo. So that's the nine base military camos done. That's the two specialty camos. Now we've just got to get 10 kills rapidly 15 times, which is simple. So we got to get kills, see a slaughter medal. Keep going. Massacre or massacres. 15 massacres, not slaughters. Massacres. Slaughters five. There's a slaughter. Keep going until there's a mass and rad bullets. There's a massacre. Another massacre. Ooh, insta kill. That's that's gonna make it uh, a little too easy, actually. There's a massacre. Give it a second. Reload. Give it a second. Reload. Oh. Did not realize there was like five manglers across the corner. Just absolutely blasted the crap out of us. Oh, great. And we can't make any progress this round. But there's no way we're going to get 10 rapid kills on the stupid spiders. I don't even think 10 can spawn in at a time. Oh, my. These last like 16 years. The next DLC map is going to be out by the time this round's over. Thank you. All right. All we got to do is get some more massacres and we'll be done. That's all we need. And then we'll have gold. Oh, there we go. I was done. This was by far the most pleasant grinding experience I've ever had on Liberty Falls. This Easter egg completely changes this map when it comes to camo grinding. Like a thousand percent. Well, I guess we're done now. So if we go, um, I'll, I'll keep this game. We'll save and quit. But let's see our camos. So we got the universal chlorine camo, the universal haunted camo, and the mystic gold for the AK. You know, we could load these into a private match in MP, but it honestly might be quicker to put on chlorine. Ooh. All right, chlorine's pretty fire. It's a light yellow with white, and it looks a lot different than all the other universal camos we've unlocked. Then we've got the haunted universal camo, and it's, um, I mean, it's more zombie themed, but it's got a little too much going on for my liking. Probably not going to use it. And obviously, we can't finish off the video without showing off the Mystic Gold camo. Here it is on the AK. I highly recommend doing this Easter egg on Liberty Falls. It's pretty easy to do. You just buy the sniper, shoot the cans, get dead shot. But it makes a massive difference when camo grinding. It made getting all of the headshots for this weapon massively easier. If you guys want to see more camo grind videos like this in the future and want to watch us unlock the Nebula camo, make sure to unlock the sub button. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Peace. Lego unlocked. He's Lego unlocked. It's going to unlock all these camels.